Hi folks, today we're looking at a Marantz 2220B and this one is on the bench because its tuner does not tune. So as you can see, it doesn't exactly move the needle and you can see up at the top here that the uh, string for moving the needle is uh, really, really slack. And if we put a little bit of pressure on it back here, you can see that it, uh, you know, works a bit better with some pressure on it there. And uh, after some, some investigation, I thought initially, uh, looking here at the knots up here and at the uh, different color of the uh, thread, this is, this is my first 2220B. I don't know if the... Uh, Thread was originally colored with this green, and there's brown back here. I don't know if that's original. I was thinking maybe the uh, the winding had been replaced and uh, potentially not uh, tensioned right. But then I took a look. Right here at the, uh, this is the tuning capacitor itself, and it became pretty apparent what the problem was that the uh, tensioning spring here isn't connected to anything. So we are definitely not going to have tension. It should be reaching out here and grabbing onto this little bit of string right here and holding tension so that it doesn't flop around like this. So I'm hoping that this will be a quick and easy fix such that uh, this works reliably as opposed to, you know, kind of not at all like it is right now. So in order to uh, get the spring hooked up, I uh, fashioned myself a uh, little hook here out of one of the uh, blown uh, diodes from the, uh, from the Sansui project. And uh, yeah, I just uh, bent, a little, bent a little hook in the end. I guess we're not going to focus. Anyway, that I can uh, go fish through here, get behind the string, and hopefully pull it through and hook the string. There we go. And I'll get my tool out. There we go. So now we'll need to work this a little bit in order to, there we go. See what it's doing here, how the spring is pulling it in. And now we should find that the tuner works much more reliably. All right. I'm pretty happy with that. I would say that uh, that counts as working. So I think we're going to call this a uh, quick, easy video for today. And uh, yeah, I hope that is uh, valuable. It's a real simple fix. The uh, hardest thing, if you have this, is uh, probably Finding something to fashion a little hook out of, a paperclip probably worked better than a uh, diode, but hey, I had a diode, I didn't have a paperclip. Uh, yeah, so I think uh, that'll do for today. Thank you as always for watching, and we will see you in the next one.